Hello and welcome back to uh, Chained Echoes. <clears throat> I wasn't actually planning on doing this again just this second, but uh, I just happened to come across literally the Carrot Man completely by chance. So it um, looks like the Carrot Man has some friends, uh, a mushroom, mushroom dog, a uh, terrifyingly um, floaty uh, capsicum dude, uh, honestly quite chill. <laughs> broccoli or, or, or uh, I don't know, maybe it's a uh, Brussels sprouts or something. And um, well, it appears to be a seductive corn. So obviously I had to share this with you all. So uh, yeah, we've got Cornelia, of course. Can we steal from any of them? Apparently, like, yes, we can steal from a couple of them. The mushroom and uh, the broccoli. Well, that's just what it is. It's broccoli. Well, we'll steal from broccoli. Pop a nugget. Those are rare. And that hurts. Okay, we really need to start taking these things out quickly. So, Broccoli, you've now been stolen from, so... Alright. Wide swing, that won't hurt everyone. That will hurt everyone, but won't kill anyone, so we're fine. Pepper pain, not bad. Alright, let's double up on Broccoli's damage there. And then see if we can steal something from the last character, the the mush, mush the mushroom. All right, another couple of nuggets. That was totally worth it, bro. Kali, oh, I get it. Why doesn't he have glasses on? Well, bro, Kali is about to die. I hope. Oh. I mean, I wasn't expecting to just actively kill him. Okay. I should probably heal you. Yes, let's uh, give you a helping hand, Sienna. Alright, I feel like we can probably... Everyone's weak against fire, so... Cornelia, I'm sorry, you make me very uncomfortable. I don't like my corn with lips. It's, you're doing nothing to me. I, I'm... Why, why am I hurting Cornelia? Because she's creepy. Okay? I'm sorry. All right, we can use this to get a little bit further down and get a buff. No longer be overheated. Um, we might also be able to use our ultra move. I should probably rather use fire, but that's okay. I mean, if it kills them all, it kills them all. That'd be fantastic. Okay, Cornelia is gone. All right, we can keep going backwards. Um, shit, we don't really need to. So yeah, it's attack normally. Land energy. I mean, that might actually help to get our healer back up to full. Good. Alright, so two of them are dead. They have quite sad death animations, it turns out. Yeah, let's change you back and use your Kogiri. I know you're quite weak, but... Okay, mushroom's dead. Pepper. Pepper, pepper, pepper. And then finally. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I feel so bad. Um. Ah. Uh... Well, I can steal from the Shashklik, and now it's sashimi. Oh, I got a meal. Very nice. Act twice. That's not good. What the? Okay, I assume you're still weak to fire, so... Um... Um, I wish I could swap you out. You, you, you don't do much when you can't heal. Just could have defended against you, but that's okay. Can't steal from you again? Nope. X slash then. No pedal storm? No pedal storm. Oh! Ow! Okay, let's oil slash. Coat this guy with a little bit of olive oil. And honestly, uh, we have the healer next, so we should be alright, but. 
if I get this good person and then I change back to an oh use poor I can buff it's not great but it'll do and then we'll awaken oh shit maybe I should use his, his overdrive okay one person sleep and it's the bloody healer okay I think it's time we use the I oh, may use one of the individual ones. Let's use Oil Slash. I sure we got Oil Slash. Armor Break. Ow. Okay. You're not asleep, which means I can use. I don't even know how much attack, how much damage you guys have, but wait, could I have gotten rid of your attack twice? Uh, I don't know. Let's find out next turn, I guess. Okay, you know what? Yeah, TP up. Ah, oh, maybe I should have used the. Okay, oil it up again. Bro! Okay. We have to see if we can cleanse this act twice. Not missed. Alright, um, we can't use heal all. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to use the other attack then, aren't I? All right, let's um, just use wide swing for now. He can heal with his ability. All right, HP regen, but TP regen more importantly. Okay, cross slash because we need to get back down off overheat. It's not a bad attack anyway. Um, I should use an overdrive item, shouldn't I? Oh shit! What do we need to overdrive right now? It says debuff or poison, I think. Oh shit! What is that class type? Utility? Uh, utility maybe. I don't know which one it is. Ah. Well, it's purple. We've got purple, so let's just use the purple normally. I think it must be utility, but anyway. Alright, now that one. Okay, actually, we're fine. We can use a regular attack. Ow. All right, let's use our uh, earth damage to one. Good, good. Um, I think we need to use a snack. Need a snack. I feel like a meal is probably a second level healing arm, but let's not. Oof. Oh no, why you have to attack twice? Oh fudge, okay. This isn't good. This is not good at all. Angel wing on our healer who's apparently gone which is good okay healer heal all please fudge he does not heal very much does he oh i wish i could get you to use you know what at this point we just got to use healing we just got to use attack sorry okay now you are quite low on health. Everyone is. Does meal heal everyone? Fix oil and fix dry. Uh, revise the character. No, we don't have anything which heals the whole batch of people. Okay. Guess we won't get till the end. Cross slash. Let's go. It applied, applied oil, which is good. Oh shit. Oh shit. Come on. Why are you using four attacks at once? Okay. We need to get our healer back up. I gotta heal all. Even though I should be reviving the other person. Okay. 
Angel Wing. Okay. This is fine. Let's uh, get X Slash on. I don't know how much attack damage they've got left, but given they've been healing themselves every few turns, I'm guessing we don't have very much. And the fact they keep on attacking multiple times per turn. Heal all again for us as well. Okay. We've got a pill for the lower overheat. Oil slash or armor break. I think we're about to die. Can we even run from this? No, we can't. Oh, lovely. All right, Angel Wing on the healer again. We don't have anything for him. Oh, no, this is not good. Okay, let's change back to the other guy. He'll have more health, and if we can just use his abilities. Pressure point. No. Unless he can heal everyone, but I doubt it. Well. Let's load the autosave and try and make note of where that is and then just go continue on the character, the, the mission. Because, okay, apparently we can't take... Oh, no. 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 No, no. Ah. Uh, bloody hell. Be right back. Okay. We made, a, we made a discovery here and I don't necessarily appreciate it. I'm not going to delete this or anything. I know where he is now. And, um, that's good. I wish, wish I could beat him, but that's okay. So after that little bit of a false start to the episode, uh, let's, uh, continue on our way. Wouldn't have been the first time we beat something, um, that we weren't meant to beat, but... Oh well. Alright, let's go talk to this corrupt guy and see what he's got for us today, I suppose. Oh, well, he's got a relatively nice house. Should straighten up his rugs, though. Like, they're all just really tattered, really. And they've got, like, tripping... Is he not worried about being sued? Okay, well, no one intent... No one seems to be talking to us down. Ah, uh, damn it, that's too tight. I'm sorry. My fiancé will return any moment. Make haste. Sir. Uh, uh, excuse me. Ugh. Oh. It's 200 arc per permit. I have four f left for a total of 800. What? You're here for the passes, right? You're not the first here today. Since the border being closed, you can only cross it with a special permit. I'm the only one issuing them. At least, the only one that doesn't ask unpleasant questions. And we can certainly pass the board with these? Who do you think I am? I'm not doing anything illegal business here. These are officially issued permits. Every civil servant has the right to issue them at their own discretion. Becca! Where the hell are you? I'm waiting. Oh, sorry, that's the wife. Becca! W Becca, where the hell are you? I'm waiting. Are there a second, my sweet little honeybee? How l how long do you need? You've been trying to fix these trousers for hours. I I'm sorry, I'm almost done. You guys still here? Sorry, we're doing a rehearsal for our wedding today. Not the best timing. Parents on the table. Put the money back, uh, put the money there and take them. Four passes are not enough. I'm sorry, that's all that's left. We'll take them for the time being. At worst, only four of us will be across the border. They cover the cost this time. I've got some travel money that's, that's left. You take the map on the table if you want it. Think of it as a little perk that comes with the permits. I've marked a safe route through the mountains for you. Becca, where are you? Please leave now. Oh. Let's put these permits to use and head to the border. Isn't it strange? What do you mean, Sienna? As I understand it, he's been selling regular passes for quite some time now. With the border closure and need for special permit, he could charge extra. Yeah, he sells them only 200 arc. Why would he do that? I was wondering that myself. Uh, don't look at gift horse and mouse. We can cross the border, please. 
Everything's fine, right? Uh, let's go then. I kind of feel like we're about to get arrested. But before then, I want to explore the rest of his house and see if we can steal four, 600 arc worth of stuff. Or 800 arc worth of stuff. I'm guessing not, though. Let me guess. Shocking. I hate this job. Not because of the task, but more so because of the, this guy, Becca. He's in... Ah. Have you been listening? I said I love this job, especially Sir Becca. Yeah, I don't like Sir Becca, no. And we've got the backing area back here with some... Okay. This all seems far too easy. However, that cloak will be nice. I'm a nun, really? Oops. Guess I'll put you in the cloak then. You are a spellcaster, so it only makes sense, I suppose. Oh, I would have loved to have gotten that. Uh, I would have loved to have gotten that last class token before moving on. But we still don't have enough. And there's nothing else we can really do that we can't that we haven't already done. Like we can't delete the leaping frog, that's too hard. Same with the attack building. The buried treasures seem to be somewhere that we don't have access to, although I could find that out for sure. Let's see. Roland Fields. Um buried treasure. Let's have a look here. Treasure checklist. Here we go. All right. Dancing City in Farnsworth. Where one backs was there? Wait, what? Yeah, no, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for treasure, like buried treasure. Alright, looks like. I don't know if they're actually going to be in range for us, but I can see approximately where they are now on the map. There's a map that's been posted there. I see two we've already found. Okay, look, it's the only way I'm going to get class token and get through. I, can't, I don't want to miss that, so. Alright. So, according to this map, it is, oh, wait, over here, which we can't get to. Can we go over here? I think it said over here, which we've definitely searched before. Okay. Okay. Okay, game. We've definitely searched around there before, but I guess my button mashing really didn't work. Okay, that's fine. Well, that's okay. We can teleport to the other area, I believe. Sort of. This is a multitude of... Uh... Alright. We're not going over, here, over there yet. I oh, damn it. Hey, you! Greetings, you want to cross the border? Another guy tried to cross those travels. Another guy, let me guess, you got some special permits from Becker and Basil, alright? Someone bent, bends the law, he's pretty well known. My name is Jan, and well, can I take a look at your permits? Why? Becker's a crook, I wouldn't trust him an inch. As far as I know, he's entitled to official issue permits, but official permits. Let me just take a look. I was right, these are fake. They won't get you far. That's nonsense, who are you anyway? Let's just say I'm in the same business. <sighs> I guess you want to sell some real pasta then, don't you? No, I just want to be nice and give you guys a warning. Warning received. Thank you very much for taking your precious kind, sir. Uh, youngsters nowadays. Just try those permits, you'll see. I don't want to try the permits yet. I just want to uh, 
go past it and find ooh, that for one. Um, hmm, hmm, dark attack. All right, it's okay. It's okay. All right, let's have a look at this map. Here we go here. We can pass the Sarah first. Oh shoot. Well, it should be said, these are less scary to me nowadays. A, I can't even steal from them. So it doesn't, like, it's not like I have to do anything special. B, they're pretty weak in terms of that they do use a almost one-shot kill, but as long as we keep taking out these things, we should be alright. It doesn't seem like it does any direct attacks very often. That's the main thing. Which I've noticed about finding these guys. Alright. Well, not all the crystals have recovered. Also... I don't know if there's only two crabs versus three. <clears throat> there's a non-zero chance I could take down those crabs if we can't find this last bit of buried treasure. But I'm hoping it will be as simple as it suggests, which should be apparently right, right over. Wait, what? Right here? Oh, I was just totally overthinking that, wasn't I? All right. Well, if that's the case, is that enough to get? the final reward okay then chain rewards yes we have sacred water technically you'd think we would have had a couple since um we would have gone okay i don't know let's just go back and see actually wait did we claim those maybe we gotta press something else to claim them no M. Oh, it is! MMM! Oh, So all this time I already had a Sacred Water ready. Oh, that's just embarrassing. Oh well, at least I don't feel so bad about cheating for the, um... things now. Well, say cheating. I, I just looked up a guide, which is not exactly uncommon. Alright. Let's go see what fight we gotta do to get for us these guys. I would like to uh, pray to the frog hero. I greet ye, adventurers of Valandas. My voice, echoing through thy heart, shall bestow upon thee the power of angels long gone. Prove thyself worthy, and thou shalt receive a gift. Oh, wow, four at once? Oh, that's not good. Uh Okay. Yoko Giri. Those things are not nothing. So let's definitely use our ultimate move. Or an ultimate move, not the ultimate move, mind. There are still others. Oh boy, um, cross slash again. Um, uh, no use in healing yet. Let's keep doing AoE. I mean, that AoE is getting pretty well, like, pretty good, so. I might just pilfer and then heal her. Ooh, sterile mucus. That's actually pretty rare. We have not gotten much of that. I clearly haven't been doing this very much to these horses. Oh boy, that's not good. Okay, first things first. Angel wing. Is that way? Okay. Heal overdrive. Get that overheat back. And heal all. Just guess close to overdriving again, but uh, overdrive removing again, but still. Alright. 
and then hope oh damn I was hoping we could keep these okay just attack him please no no oh no there's too many of them this time we swap back out again he's a power shot on the strongest loss and then uh, uh oh I think I'm gonna have to heal because if I don't heal him there's a chance he dies and then we don't get to use his healing Oh great, instead we have to use the healing on him. Oh no. Stop attacking the same guy, please! I don't appreciate this. There are still two people with tons of HP. Okay. Bloody hell. These horses are very strategic for horses. Okay, this is just ridiculous. There's nothing I can do. They're not even attacking the bowmen. Yes, using AoE was not the right move. Okay. This is not fine, but if we try and focus on single targets next time, we may have a better chance. Here's hoping it lets us restart from the battle start. This is just going to be the tale of many losses at this point. Oh, it's actually letting us... Oh, yeah, we haven't actually learned the extra skill yet. Um, health point or 10%. How much health do you have, Glenn? Problem is... It's not actually telling me. Um... Let's tell me the skill points. I can't actually... Okay, so I don't actually know if 15 is better than, than 10%. He would have had... At least 200 HP. Wait, no, would he? He may only have 100 or something. Oh, it's gotta be a way I can check his skills. Maybe... If I go into equipment? Okay, 120. Okay, then that means we'll only give him 12. Through the other way. So... We can learn... This for 15 rather than 12. And probably get some more as well, which is nice. Um, okay. These guys were attacking us in lots of ways, to be honest. I think for now, HP all around. And, um... Defense. And again, safety. Oh, dang, you really need some more abilities. Let's go for leg aim. Okay, you've got some pretty powerful things already. Undead, dragon, no, it's neither of those things. You get 5% to your critical. Okay. Attack, I guess? Not that I really attack too much with you, Rob, but anyway. Heavy armor bonus. Hmm. Def up. I don't think I've got you wearing heavy armor. Mind, mind. Let's get magic up by two. Because you do have some pretty decent magical spells. All right, let's try again. Okay. First of all, let's start with an ultra move on just one horse. Sloss. So we've got to take him down, apparently, because there's just too many of them. Okay. Jelly buff, griff buff. Okay. So. Leg aim. Where are you? You're back here. So, yeah, let's just get you. One of them sparkling. Okay, it's water to get you weak, so let's just go with the water frost. 
These losses seem stronger than the ones I'm used to as well. And again, they were always pretty strong. Let's get armor break on this loss. Okay, very good. Okay. X slash, we just gotta deal with it. No AoE. Keep going. Okay. Water Frost and one will be gone. Good. Next, let's use a heal. Because you've all earned it. One sloss is down. Let's go for the next sloss. Let's go for the shiny sloss. Hey, okay, crap. We're overheated. Uh oh. Why is it always the characters I can't swap out? Okay. Let's get another angel wing out there. Already. Okay. Water thrust on the thor the sloss. Okay. Armor break on the sloss. Heal all once again. Okay, good, good. Ow. Okay, well you are getting sent out of there. Then again, I could also have gotten you to. Oh, I might have to get you to. Oh, it's too late now. Or is it? I can find out if this is. I don't know if it's debuff or utility. Let's see what happens. No. Ah, it's utility. Okay. Alright. Ouch. Water Frost on this loss again. Alright. Sorry, defense break. Let's. Let's. I mean, strong against fire, so. Okay, good. Good. Okay, to a point, good. Like. It's not perfect. Everyone's still very much in pain, and now he's dead. So maybe we have a different definition of very good, but. Fudge. I've got to use angel wings again. <sighs> Bloody hell. Wait, you can just heal. Why don't you just... You know what? Let's heal everyone. It's 60 HP versus slightly less. Or 40 HP, apparently. Okay, that's not very much at all. Okay, this isn't good. Victor? Okay, this game is, um... Might just change... She's only got 19 HP too. God damn it. Okay. And you can't use your your move yet, so just keep on reviving people until you can use your move, I suppose. I don't know how I'm meant to be using any moves at this point. They take... 50, they, they take like most of my HP down at once. Helping hand um, to Glenn. But that's only one horse attack. Maybe two if we're lucky. Okay, attack Lin uh, heal Lenny first. Because the ultimate move is ideally what we want to get going. And he's dead. Now we are this this horse this lot of horses is like literally impossible for us right now. And I have no way of stopping it either. Like you couldn't even say, well you could just um double down killing the horse horses because like each one does so much damage to me. Gotta be something else we can do. It's gotta be something else we can do. Something, anything. We don't have any other abilities, do we? No. 
We could move who has this, but honestly, he's kind of useless. In fact, he's kind of useless. That's a good point. Why is he even in the front line? I could probably knock him out with Rob. Yeah, let's get Rob in the front line. And Killian in the back, because he's not nearly as good as he could be. Also, what equipment changes can we make? Anything? Well, for one, he's no longer in the front row, so he doesn't need Cleric anymore. I think she, he's still best to be Cleric, because he, he seems to be much better at healing, because he is a magic user, so... I honestly don't know what else we can do here. I think we're just going to have to give up on this. All right. First of all, I did like the idea of using just the one. One target one. Ow. Now, I'm not sure what's best, if it's healing or if it's not, but... Wow, that didn't take long. They, they decide to do what I was doing. You know what? The explosive track might work perfectly here. Because we know they like to uh, pick on the weak. Damn it, must only be on the other person. I was hoping it was on the slot, but no. The only thing I can do is healing for this, but I'll just use the heal overdrive. We've got to stay out of the, uh, out of the overheat part, I think, because that killed us last time, I believe. It lowers our defense or something. And because each of their attacks gets us closer on the overdrive forge, there's nothing we can really do besides just keep on healing and doing whatever it wants us to do. We're sort of dependent on... Okay, Slaughter's one should be going down, right? Okay. Good. Okay, we're overheating again, which is I need to land energy. Okay, I think that may be the issue as well. But no, it's still taking a lot of... It's taking a lot of hits. And we're still overheat! Bloody hell. Okay, Explosion Tap again. And then heal all. God damn it, they're all bloody strong. And we're still in overheat, so we gotta go back down. Utility. Not like we got many choices at this stage, do we? Good cross slash, we're good enough, but then they'll attack me anyway, so. Oh god, look how much it's going up! Okay, this is bad. It's another explosive trap. Not that they've worked in the past. They seem to be too str too strong for that, but... Okay, that didn't... How long do these traps work? They're all so high health. Oh, thank fuck for that critical, but it won't help me much. Okay. Power shot. He's got to change back out off until...
He's got to swap back out somehow. Unless this will be enough to get him his attack. If I'm lucky, it will, because he's next. Come on, ultimate move. Okay. It's only going to give him... Well, it gives everyone TP back. I just wish it would also heal. I don't think he looks like he's blowing his trumpet when he does that. And of course, when they die, they probably lose that regen too. And now they're all dead. Bloody hell. Wait, what? Okay, fuck that! This is the most unsuccessful... Oh no, did I just accidentally re-bloody start it again? I think I did. Okay. Fuck that. Nope. I'm out. Okay. Well, damn it. Am I right or am I right? Well, you can't really, like, I can't really grind either. That's the worst part. Like, I definitely feel like I'm getting more powerful, though. So it is, like, happening slowly. But, like, so are the enemies I'm facing. I just think I need a couple more players, to be honest. A couple more characters and I'd be okay-ish. Alright, let's go try and use our, our fake passes then. See what happens. Oh boy. This will go poorly, I can already tell it. Just like everything else in this episode. Crossing the border is only allowed for special permits. What's this? A special permit? You don't have first try these today. Where'd you get them? They were issued by the city of Farnsport. By a man named Becca, by chance? They're fake. Fake? I thought Becca was entitled to issue official documents. Well, he is. That's true. I have no clue why he gave you these fakes. Normally, I would now take you into custody. But since you're not the first to do this, I believe the fault lies with Becca. You've been conned. Now leave. I knew he was suspicious from the very beginning. This is getting on my nerves. What a waste of time. But why would he be issuing fakes? It makes no sense. Maybe he's a crook after all. Who can really tell if this guy's a legitimate civil servant? If there's someone who knows a thing or two who crack crooks at Sienna. I'll take that as a compliment. At least you call me by my name for once. Well, thanks to these counterfeits, the army now has it on radar. But would a man who's, who's about to be married really take this to risk? Something's wrong here. That's a fact. Let's return to Becca. So, I, is it implying that maybe he wasn't trying to do it to us? That's interesting. All right, well, let's um, go back then. Yeah, we don't get the next star until we actually get through, unfortunately. I'm guessing that's what that means anyway. Oh, hello, you must say say. I don't think I've seen you before. Hey, mister, give me five arc and I'll tell you a secret. Sure. Awesome. East City, Farn Spot. We follow the coastline now. You'll reach Termia Caves. Just follow this huge old tree in a pool of water. It's with the tree from behind. Reach the cave. Don't know what's in there, though. 
I think I've already done that. That sounds very familiar. You can't do this to us. We gave you our money. And I gave you genuine permits. Oh, you've returned as well. Let me guess. They told you your permits are fake. You should have expected that, giving us fakes and such. As I told these guys next to you, my passport's a real deal. Just think about, why should I fake them? Oh, damn it. Now Yama will pay me a visit. Shit! When Jolana feels about this. Are you telling the truth? Of course I am. I want to get married soon and lead a quiet life here in Basil. I don't want any problems with the authorities. If we were to believe that the man on the border, then you've been dealing out counterfeits for some time. Wait, what guy? Oh, he stole our bloody... His name is Jan. He stole them. Jan, you've met him? Wait. You had the passes? I want to take a look at them. We had our permits over as well. Oh, you bloody drunkard. He switched the passes for fakes. I highly doubt it. I would have noticed. The guy's a thief. He knows how to trick people. He's probably laughing his ass off right now. Damn it! Say, can you help me out with this, this, this? You probably won't get your permits back for him. While you're at it, you can make sure he won't do this again. This mess needs to be cleared. I guess we've got no other choice to show it, such as Jan. So, where do we start? Back to the border? Uh, wait, wasn't that Jan? Was he eavesdropping? He's running towards the beach. After him. Well, at least for once, we're having things sort of going our way. We at least know who the bad guy is. Well, I mean, I'm sure there's multiple bad guys in this situation. He's still using his... I mean, 200 arc isn't that bad, really. There's a lot of things... Uh, okay. It's where that bloody carrot came from. I wish I could take down that carrot, too. This has been a series of... Un this has been a series of unfortunate events. Of me overestimating my power. Or my ability. I can't really tell which. Let's just teleport down there, to be honest. Like, we've got a teleport there. We might as well use it. Worst case scenario, it gets too hard. We just downgrade the difficulty a little bit, I suppose. This seems all way too easy. I say that, but last time we had one of these bastards at us, it didn't end well. Plus, last time we had four of these bastards, so, you know. Oh, damn, these are actually pretty heavy on their health. Let's go for a cross slash to try and focus them. Perfect excuse. Damn it. I mean, I have a hard time feeding one of these guys, so I shouldn't have been surprised I lost a four. And they dropped the slime. Uh, damn it, I'm gonna have to fight more slosses, aren't I? <laughs> the Rohan field seems to be getting more and more dangerous every day now. <laughs> you look angry. They didn't let you through with the butcher's Becca's fake permits, did they? What what are you doing? We know exactly what you're trying to fool. Switching the passes of fakes. What are you doing with the real ones? Selling them? No, no, wait, you got it all wrong. Are you telling us that if we check your pockets we won't find our real passports there? Well no, well yes, yes, but how could you? A war may start at any moment. Instead of supporting one another, you steal from people? I, I can explain. I've heard enough. Hmm, Lana is right. I still don't trust this Becca. 
What is Janice saying in his defense? All right, well, uh, we'll give you a minute. So, Becca's passwords. Yeah, they're real. It's true he doesn't deal with forgeries, but it doesn't make these passwords himself either. Becca's stolen for other people. He's not a silver servant. He's a robber. The passwords are stolen. Did he offer you a map to supposedly safe route for the mountains? Do you know what awaits you on that trail? His own band of brigands. They'll take your gold, equipment, the passports, and bring them back at Becca. That's how he earns a living. People are going missing in Kotra. It's pretty common, so no one would expect a thing. The past isn't returned and used for his next victims. That would explain why he only had a couple of them, yeah. You can't be serious. I guess why he only gave you four passports, not because he didn't have any more. He just wanted to make sure that his gang was capable of robbing you. Oh, the mountain pass. Six armed fires would be too risky for him. Hmm, I almost believe this guy here. You don't follow a sophisticated idea of this out thin air. But the end doesn't matter. Let's take our passports and move on. We'll take another route for the mountains. Unfortunately, the passports aren't much use to you. Becca must have missed it, but there's blood on some of your passports. So what? According to law, passports with blood stains are invalid. It's intended to prevent robberies. Becca's men must have gotten sloppy during last robbery. Does this mean we have to go back to Becca again? Yes, but this time there are no more excuses. If his throat were to be at the mercy of your sword, you could extract the information from him about his particular passageway. There are path of the bands of robbers used to bring stolen items to the mountains down with him. Why are you doing all this? What do you plan to do with stolen passports? With bloodstains are useless anyway. I have my reasons. Wait a second, are you the guy who owns the house at the beach? I have a little house at the beach, yeah. Why do you ask? What happened there? What do you mean? It was completely wrecked by a monster. But what? No, that can't be. What's wrong with him? Would we care to find out? Wonder what would happen if I didn't go there first? We didn't follow him return to Vecca. Either way, let's move. I mean, I definitely want to know what, what um, he's going on about, but like... I mean, Becca will just think that we went and got our passes. He, he won't know anything if we wait a little bit. That's fine. But who is he trying to protect? What, what happened here? Marisha, Marissa, where are you? Oh no, oh, oh no. It's, it's you. Hm, what devastation. There's blood everywhere. Over there, behind the box, there's a body. All cut up and all. Is that? That's a soldier from Taran. Marissa! Papa? Oh. She's a werewolf, isn't she? Papa, I'm so scared. Oh, thank face you well. What happened? No, okay, maybe not. But it feels like something like that. I know, I was asleep and waiting by loud noises. Everything is destroyed and the bad member gone. I think there was a monster here. I was scared and I hid. Well done. The main thing is nothing happened to you. What is the meaning of all this? Yeah, touch your unit. Let's be clear. You steal passports. We find dead bodies in your home. What does this all mean? What's the beast everyone's talking about? About Rand Wild here. Fortunately, he didn't notice my daughter. What is Soldier from Taran doing here? Speak! They came this morning. Eight soldiers from the direction of the farm sport. They claimed something terrible had happened at some banquet. Now they were, now they were wanted. They are probably the ambassador's guards. Chancellor Sigurd was searching for them. These pigs took my daughter hostage and forced me to get the passports. I tried to sell them fakes, but they noticed. And then you exchange those fakes for the border fowls we received from Becca. Yes, but careful with yours, I only had six. I was still missing two, so I had to wait longer. And you didn't care about the blood in the passport? I was hoping they would not know the law about the blood. As long as the soldiers took the passports and disappeared, I did not care whether they were allowed to leave the border or not. Well, be it as it may, the issue seems to be resolved itself, thanks to the ominous beast. Do you think the soldiers were able to escape from the monster? Look at him out of blood here. I understand. May they rest in peace. We believe your story. You should still report to the village elder. I, I will, thank you. I still think she's probably the beast. Hmm. What kind of beast can slow men like this? I still have a sneaky suspicion it's her, but... Oh well. Doesn't really matter. 
Not our fight. I will have to check this cave back here again. No, still nothing. Ugh, okay. That is not the one I was trying to teleport to. It does give me Breath of Fire vibes in the fact of the like animal, uh, humanoids, etc. But it's also quite a hard game, surprisingly. How oh, shocking, we're gonna come through right at the wedding. Though no one's here except for two bandits. You may kiss the bride. Sorry to interrupt. What, you guys again? Can't you see we're in the middle of a wedding rehearsal? We give a shit, you fucked us, Becca. What are they talking about, dear? Dissatisfied customers, apparently. Why don't you wait inside? I'll take care of this quickly. Even on a wedding day, you take your work with you. You're terrible. Alright everyone, first calm down. We know you're robbing innocent travels in the mountains. You lure them passports and maps and attack them with your brigands. Is that so? You're not surprised me. Jan is quite a blabmouth, isn't he? He worked for me until his daughter was born. After that he wanted to leave a decent life. <laughs> decent, he said. Look at him, he just lives in poverty. On the other hand, my boys here are doing pretty well, right? I get good care of them. Enough of this. Show us the way across the mountains. Why would I do that? Make a deal, or we won't let you go unpunished. How funny. I have the same save you again, boys. That's okay. I mean... Okay, can't steal from him. That's probably actually not a bad thing. Let's do an X slash. Try and take it down one at a time again. So, cross slash. Ooh, wow, they are quite strong. Oh god, I don't like that. Okay. Let's go for an oil slash then again. Fire! Wide swing. I'm a little bit, like, after how many fails there's been today, I'm sort of feeling like, you know, I'm sort of feeling like a little bit apprehensive about any fight. I, I've had only a couple of fights this turn, and I've kind of sucked at all of them, so... These ones are doing about half the health of the other ones in damage, so as long as we keep it the healing, it should be okay. Petal Storm. Oh, yeah. I realize it's going the wrong direction, but. No buts. Let's just do this and get back down. Hmm. Heal, I think. Apparently not. Ah, 
don't like how I had to go back into overheat already. Thankfully, overheat isn't large over bar. You know what? Let's just um, use a. I can't really use a regular attack either. Uh, screw it. Cross slash. Water flush. Rash. There we go. Alright, so let's do another healing. Of course, he'll be the next one we have to kill. Ah, screw it. Thankfully, only one of them left now. And thankfully every attack, every fight, heals us up, so... How strong are you people? Payback time, Becca. I don't care how a person earns a living, but you don't mess with me. Wait, wait, please forgive me, that deal is bad. How about we another? You can work for me, I pay good, and you seem to be strong enough. I think your business is finished. How'd you boys want to boot, boot the mountains back to you? There's an underground passage! Well, it's rather dangerous. If your boys can handle it, we can as well. Which way is it? Will let me go? If you promise to stop robbing people, then we'll consider it. I promise. The path you've made needs to take, take to, that leads through the Temple of the Purple Flames. The ruins to the north, I've heard they're overrun by evil creatures. My boys secured a passageway around them. Unfortunately, it collapsed during one of the earthquakes a few days ago. We're in the process of clearing it. So what does that mean for us? You have to go through the whole temple. There's an exit to Kotara, but you'll have to deal with whatever lurks in there. I'll give you key to ruins, exit Basil to north and pass the bridge, then go to the west. I feel like I know where that is. Good, I'd rather see him tail at jail, but we don't have times. The means, nor the time. We're leaving, and you're going to stop your shady business, alright? Yes! What, what's going on? Are you finished? Good luck with your wedding. Yeesh. Well, that's the path, the path, the path to Kaldora, so... That's good at least, right? If we finish, does that mean we get a second star yet? No, we do not. Damn it. Um... I wonder if I ever do get sky armors again. I assume so since it's a section of my inventory. Alright, well before we do that, we also want to... Oh boy. Still sad we couldn't do that yet. At least this gives us a reminder to come back here, but I'd like to get a little bit more power if possible. We need a thick eye, we don't have that. Okay, that can be upgraded. And it can be upgraded again. Okay, wooden bow or long bow. The, the long bow, was that better? Did I not equip that already? Why not? Oh, damn it. Let's check the rest of them before I go anywhere because apparently some of my characters all right all right well now we can upgrade that longbow not that they're using too much yet but you never know okay rapier Guns, we don't have any of those. Boken. Okay. I do. She is a pretty powerful unit I consistently use, so fair. Okay, honestly, it's our best bet. I don't know who that is. I don't remember. Did we already be interested in them or not? I don't know. 
Hmm. I guess the two characters we just don't have access to right now. I probably would remember them if I went to see the video, because clearly we've been introduced to them before. I need to watch my own video again, clearly. Alright, well let's start by leveling up. I think both of these characters are very important, so... Oh, damn it. Well, I know where Tinor comes from. Might have to do some, uh... Work. Alright. Okay, Glaive. Let's see what you can get. Attack up. Well, I mean, that's not really what you need. Mind up, though. That would help. Dry strike. Dark attack. Hmm. I don't really know which attack I want to make it. The glaive is our spellcaster. Honestly, I do use her quite a lot as an elemental attacker. So I don't necessarily want to ruin that by putting an attack on like that. I think mind. And this counter. That also raises mine, so yeah. Okay. The longbow, we don't really use this too much. Um, who do we use a lot? Well, the, 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 the sword lady, we use an awful lot. Let's give her attack up by 10. Or maybe dark attack. Hmm. Honestly, let's stick with attack up, and then we'll also can put in the, the dark up if we want to. Yeah, not the best, but it's what we got. So, all right. Annoyingly, I probably need some more healing items if you've got any. Oh, those angel wings are expensive. Though, thankfully, it looks like every time I die... Ooh! You're starting to sell some uh, other things. At least you do. So, the ashen bones probably the only thing I really... Oh, and tin enough. Let's buy all the tin off. And the ashen bones. There we go. Perfect. Last slime we don't have. Antenna, I don't think we have another one of, but we can check. And we didn't get those other couple, couple of things. Oh wait, slime. We need that. And let's also sell a couple of other things. What else is new? I don't think any of this stuff is new. Um, yeah, I think we're fine. Alright. There we go. Robe 3. Shimmering Garb. Right after I upgrade out, upgraded our um, robes already. Fantastic. Good, 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 good. Damn it. <laughs> oh, well. We probably um, upgraded anyway. We didn't put any weapon stuff into it, though, so it's fine. We'll just give the Raven Cloak to the other person. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. We didn't waste anything. Yeah, you can take the Raven Cloak plus then. Okay. And more importantly, I wonder if we could put some something else in there for him. Because that shimmering garb seems like something we won't be replacing for a while. So. If I set something in that shivering garb, because that feels like something we're not going to be going, it's not going to be going anywhere. 
TP up. Well, we were just worried about that not increased as it starts reducing our TP. Yeah, sure, get it. It does feel like we can remove it later, so as long as I remember to do so, it shouldn't be too bad. Okay. Oh boy. Let's see if we can actually turn this episode into something a little more positive. If we just get through this cave. Don't know how long it's going to take. Oh boy. Huh. The frog's gone. That's interesting. Or oh, is the frog not here and I'm thinking about the wrong place? No, it is. It, it was here, but it's not here anymore. I hope I didn't. Oh, there it is, down there now. Aww. Were you just meant to be in my way to, like, hold me back, or...? Okay, maybe just out of the way at the moment because of the story quests, which makes sense. Probably, it's like, it was... Probably it was trying to scare me away from being over here, but I just didn't listen, or didn't get scared, so... Probably should have in the long run, but oh well. I love how many birds there are everywhere. Ooh, crystal. More rare drops. That sounds very important. Ooh, Heavy Strike 3. It's also got a different color, so I'll take the different colored one, yes. Alright, here we go. Ooh, fascinating. It is indeed purple. Well, it isn't called the, pur the Temple of Purple Flame for nothing. Whew. I'm relieved. That was obviously my biggest fear going into this place. I wonder what keeps these flames going. Probably the master of this place. Whose corpses are those? Eh, some adventurers, it seems a bit strange. By their clothes, they've been dead for quite some time, but their flesh hasn't completely rotted. I wouldn't be surprised if they could start moving. Oh, come on, everyone. Can we leave these creepy stories for fairy tales and continue? Are you scared? Scared? Me? Of fairy tales? Oh, come on, darling. Fine, let's move. Finish quest. Does that mean we get a second... Does that mean we get another star? No, it does not. Not yet. We have already have the one star we haven't done. Alright, well, I'm going to go through and pick up all these items because, you know... Dead man tell no tales. Oh, apparently he does. Uh, Alright, can we steal from him? We cannot. Okay. So he's undead, so I actually don't know... So I just put undead on. Okay, seems like it's fine. Okay, strength against death, weak against light. Well, we don't have any light or death, so... Okay. Although... No. In fact, I might just use him as a regular attack at the moment. Oh, that's not good. Petal Storm! If we get attacked by multiple these at once, we're not in a great position. However... Ooh, thick hide! We needed that! Ooh, hello. Ooh, a, a parish room! Oh, a parish room, huh? I sure do like parish rooms. Okay, that's going to be more enemies. There's nothing else around here to really attack. Okay, you are very much flashy for some reason. It's like, I can't really get into attack unless there's something to attack, you know? Let's still check on these guys, because if they, if they drop Thick Hide, that's actually good for us, because we do need some Thick Hide, so... Well, we know we're going to be attacked pretty quickly over here. Yeah. Alright, well, we know also that the... If we use Jackie's Fury, will that attack the um, Parachute as well? No, we're going to directly attack the Parachute. Okay, well, we know who's going to be doing that. Bonus loot. Fantastic. That means more heavy hide. Okay. 
it'll be you. Parish room, go! Alright, that worked pretty effectively. On one. Hmm. Oh yeah, I think I actually had the the flower one already. Oops. Let's use heal. I know we don't really need it, but we also don't not need it. Petal storm, go! Alright. Skill level up. Really? I actually got a skill level up. Wow. That took a long time. Alright, so far so good. More zombies. This guy isn't actually alive, isn't he? Because I can't walk through him, but I can walk through this guy? Maybe, maybe not. Okay. Do not walk on the bloody trap doors, no. Okay. Oh fuck. Oh. <sighs> I was walking over the zombie expecting it to get up, not the bloody ghost. Oh, I can steal stuff from the ghost. More thick hide, which... Okay. Fire thrust. Counter magic resist. Uh oh. Well, this isn't magic, so. Counter physical attack. Oh, bloody hell. Okay. Well, at least I know where to get the thick hides in great numbers. Well, this one should kill it, right? And got me oil. Let's get rid of physical resist off him. Damn it. Okay, well, he's got physical resist right now, so. I don't really have. Okay, is this. Does this count as physical? I don't think so. Alright. That would, though, so let's use heal instead. So we've got a physical attack right now. These are all physical. Ah, screw it. Why are you so... Okay, I guess we just gotta use magic then, because it's the only thing we can do, apparently. Let's say weakness, so fair. Still seeing physical resist. Is he just... Uh... So the other one was countering everything. This one is just, like, immune to everything except for physical? Except for this? So let's just defend, I guess. Yeah, okay, fine. Come on. Haunt this, mother trucker. Ooh, a blanket. That... Okay. I don't want to go the wrong way and not get to explore everywhere. Oh, it's, it's frustrating. Okay, I'm not sure which way is the way we're meant to go. Oh, ooh, shiny ghost. Bonus loot! Okay, so what are you? You don't have any ability yet, so I can just attack you first of all. Cool. And you still don't have any abilities, right? Nope. Okay, physical resist just being casted. Okay, so great. We've only got one magic user. And the only one who can discharge physical... Oh no, the only one that can discharge an attack is, is my magic user, so... Oh, great. Oh well. We can oil her still. Yep. 
even really one of our characters can do anything right now. Hey, this these guys seem to drop a fair amount of good stuff. Actually, you know what? I do have a second magic user, I think. It's just... Or at least a buffer. No, she's definitely using, he's definitely using magic too, so this is fine. Okay. So never mind, we do have two physical attackers here. Actually, you know what? The oil attack worked. Maybe the, um, the block will too. Nope. Alright. Well, this is fine then. Another skill level up. So I guess technically we're going to get a bunch of skill levels. Well, that's just creepy as hell. Who the hell is this? Hey, visitors, do you like my flames? Say I'm not strong enough for the lighthouse yet. I've still got a lot to do. Um. Okay. Are you the lighthouse keeper? What are you doing here? I mean, I know they never finished the lighthouse, but that's strange. Look at all the water flowing in. This place is hold barely holding it together. This place is almost a century old. I hope it can f hold, f hold for a few more hours. Alright, well, we know where to go to this time. Actually, wait, no, I still need to pill for them, didn't I? Ah, damn it. I want that thick hide. Oh well. Really? Oh shit, did he use magic resist? Oh, I got so used to it. Okay. Yep, he's magic resisted. Oh, does it just... Does it just try and counter the first thing that happens to it? Pilfering the ghosts. Apparently they're very wealthy. Oh shit. Wrong one. My sword. Well, we've got the ability to bring out back Magic Boy then again. Perfect. Whew. Ooh, chest. Guess this goes back where we. Uh huh. There's a switch. The sound came from below. Oh, this is old school. This reminds me of the cathedral in um, Chrono Trigger. We had to go both ways around. I love it. When I arrived here, everything was covered in darkness. The master space allowed me to light this place up, and since then, more and more travelers have visited these halls. Okay. Well, at least now I know that I'm not going the wrong way, because both ways is the right way, and it's a fantastically designed dungeon. Beautiful. Interesting. Literally, there's a lot of stuff blowing. Oh, wow, that's three at once. Okay. Um, still can't pilfer any of them, right? Okay. 
So let's start by attacking the parish room. There we go. And then just... Oh, I should probably should use my ultra move. I think I use his ultra move. It's pretty powerful. It does some debuffs as well, so... Yeah. Yeah, that's... Uh... Yeah, that's probably the one I should use against those horses. It does attack and defense and everything for three turns. Shame I can't bring a parish room with me. To those bloody horses. Zombies in JRPGs are never as scary as jo zombies in um, most other fiction. Like most other fiction, zombies are sort of like, well, in zombie movies, for example, they're very contagious. Here it's just like anyone can take a bite. Apparently, we can take a bite. There's some zombie flesh there. Yum, yum. Fantastic. Okay, another mushroom. Another healing angel wing, which I'll never say no to, because if we need them, we definitely need them in great numbers. All right, attack overdrive. Also, another thing we have actually been using sometimes. Yeah, fascinating. Switch. And then... No one else, okay. Once again, not walking on those trapdoors. If I were you, I would turn back immediately. I'm thankful for my master for allowing me to stay here with the flame, but he isn't very nice to other researchers. So. Alright, first things first. Ghost, one hide, please. Yeah, I might actually take the zombies first. That way, this ghost doesn't get any... Oh, actually, wait, there we are. He'll get physical resist now. Oh, well, it's fine. Honestly, the zombies are fairly basic, but these ghosts can be a bit of a pain. I'm a break. Whew. Uh oh. I have not been watching her health. Wagon Spirit. Bloody hell. Uh oh. I gotta take down this ghost. Ooh, sweets. You can take my energy, Killian. And please use it to heal everyone. I should use my ultimate move, actually. Hmm. Ok. 
Come on. All right, cool. Ouch, but it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Huh. This part is surprisingly traversable, but... Oof, okay. There's definitely something in there. Can I just climb in the... No. There's a chest in there, though. Damn it. Oh. Really? Huh, fair enough, I suppose. Worth it for the power lies, I guess. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk over there so I don't think it's that sort of thing. Alright, here we go. Time for the master. Oh, please have this boss fight go better than the last few boss fights. Those last few are optional, so... Well, fudge. Great. Just, just great, actually. Um, let's start with our Dream Eater. Deals high physical damage to one enemy and raise... Oh, that's what I'm using currently. Yes. Please, Dream Eat this gigantic pile of humongous... Ah! <laughs> Skulls. <laughs> it's now in the... Oh, that's beautiful. I love it. Alright, what do we actually have here? We can steal from him. We don't know much else. Okay. God damn, we have not had much good luck with bosses at the moment. Ah, screw it. We can give him a weakness through oil. And... I think you're honestly the one who should be able to swap out, but... Hmm... You know what? No, let's just get you to do a regular attack. I need you to keep me on heal. Okay. Let's pilfer, because we don't know what he's got. Another silver breastplate. I will take that. Can pilfer again? No. That would be too good, wouldn't it? Alright. X-Slash. Cleanse. You don't have any abilities, so I'll just uh, take advantage of your weakness. It's a fire. Okay. I can lend energy, but I don't think it's worth it at this point. So let's ar armor break. Cool. I can heal, and I think that is worth it. Because he'll just he'll attack me over the line anyway. And also, I can't, I can't heal very much. For the 27 is not very much. Alright, X slash again. Okay. Oh, bloody hell. Uh, you still got oil, but I don't know what these things are. Screw it. Attack the orbs. We can't risk them doing something. They're actually quite weak. Uh, let's do a regular attack on the spirit orb. Oh. Well, that was useful. Cool. Well, let's use some AoE attacks while we can, then. Okay, that one's less cool. But still, oil! Okay, we can still pilfer, but we don't need to. Our attack is fine. Let's use Petal Storm. Okay. And we'll use another oil, because we know that's been very effective so far. Ooh, you need to heal. Heal all, please! Uh-oh. We're into overheat mode. That's not good. Let's see what we can do. Apparently needs attack. We can't use physical, I guess, that is. So attack overdrive? Yeah, attack overdrive will do it. Okay, good. Good, but we still got oil, so... We can lend energy. That will be a helpful thing to do in general, because she's going to run out if we don't. Okay. Heal all again. This is working out fine. Okay, fire for us. We don't have any more oil, unfortunately. So 
Rogue March. Heal everyone. Okay, we're going to get another Ultra Move. So let's use it. That's all. You know what? No, let's not use against that. Let's use Oil Slash again. And then... So against all, so... You can just use Heal again. I think the best one is actually going to be the Healing Guy, because he'll restore our TP. And give us a... Um, regeneration. Which at the moment we don't need, but we will, I think. Oh, that's cool. Well, we know what those orbs do if we break them. We... Ooh, Parish Room. Okay. Good. Ultra Attack. Take advantage of it. Reclaim our TP. Get some regeneration going. Alright, good. Good, 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 good. So you can use Helping Hand on you. Okay. Uh, then we use a... Oh shit, I just realized something. He has also got a heal right now, so... Let's take down these if we can. Okay. Screw it. It's fine. We can heal. We got the TP for it. Ow. Okay, not nice. You've got four turns of HP regen. How much are you even regening? I've not been paying attention. Okay, let's get oil back on you. I probably want to disable this HP regen if I can as well. Hundred and seven. Oh god, I did not notice it was that much. Get rid of the HP regen if you can. Oh good. Oh good, okay. Armor break. I am also noticing we've been overheat for a very long time with no way of getting it down. Um I think it's utility, let's go. And we're gonna do it again, aren't we? Do an attack one. Okay. Don't stress too badly. Weakness quite high. You've got defense in mind. You can go back to oil again. Oh, that's going to send me the overdrive if I don't if I don't use a magic thing. Um, buff overdrive. Okay. Oh damn it! We are not getting any luck with our bloody overdrives, are we? You are though. X slash should do it. Perfect. Alright. Let's do a fire for us. We've got enough to play with now. And another oils slash. Come on. I don't know how much this thing's got left, but... This all reminds me of Lavos with the constant changing. Okay, well... Al, first of all, heal everyone, then kill the spirit orb. Someone. Um, let's get you to kill it. Actually, we'll just use this and do a... There we Kill them all. We'll get the bomb, sure, but we'll also get... Yeah, we didn't get the other one. Hmm. Oh, yeah, shit. Gotta cleanse him. Okay. Now cross slash back on spirit orb. Get us back under overheat to overdrive. Every time it's him, he seems to kill that gun. Okay. This is fine. We can change him back to the other character. And use earth drums. Heal all. Perfect timing. Okay, we've also got another ultra move, apparently, too, which we can use next turn. Might actually have to be the other guy again, I think. 
And then again, we can raise the her TP that way. Maybe we should just go for a damaging one instead. If we go for hers, it's pretty effective. It's not the first time we've had this happen. Oh shit, it gives it a Jillian crit buff. Oh, we can get rid of that next time. With cleanse. Oh, actually, no, it didn't. Okay, cool. Fire then. Oh. Let's do it. Yeah, that boss reminded me sort of Lavos, actually, even with the two regenerating cores. And this entire place reminded me of the um, cathedral section of the medieval section. So, yeah. Nice. And we got another shard. And we're through. Oh, and we get the ability to... Um, okay. Odd. Why are they giving me the ability to re to upgrade my weapons here? That concerns me. That concerns me quite a bit, actually. Look up there, night sky, we're almost out of here. Lynn? What's wrong? Nothing, I'm fine. It's been a long day, maybe she rest. Nene is right, at night time, Kotoa is even more dangerous. So I sense no evil around anymore, we should probably rest here. I'll go ahead and see if I can fit some fire warden in front of the cave. And so it happened, we reached the palace together. So it's thanks to the fates that we were able to defeat this beast with our combined forces. One saw not less, and this red-eyed creature would have eaten us. And Fate's meddling did not stop there. Now you're helping me get back to Toronto. I am indebted to you. Hmm, <laughs> you know how to show your gratitude. I do, and you'll not regret it, trust me. What are you doing in Farnsworth? I mean, you are a princess that works as a city guard. I had my reasons to leave the castle. I was prisoner within the castle walls for too long. It was time to see more of the world. <laughs> and the kingdom could do without a princess? I knew not enough of Eldus, nor its people. The way I was back then, I could never have done my tale justice. Hm. A very liberal attitude, I must say. My brother is no difference. The well-being of the people is his pious priority. In the end, my being in Farnsworth allows me to carry the truth to my brother. So I guess it, I made the right choice. Hm. I wonder if he'll be willing to receive this truth. This last of the firewood it should be enough for tonight. The wood of Arania is most fitted for a campfire. If the flames are too powerful for the last long time. You seem to know a bit about campfires. Aren't you the son of a lord? Unusual for a young man of your background. The sons of the House of Ryaman must train for a year in the woods with its rangers. Why is that? Tradition. That sounds pretty atypical for a young man of your background. It is said that my ancestors once chased from this castle by his enemy. He hid in the forest for a year and was declared dead. Secretly, however, he gathered a resistance that was able to reconquer Rinomir Castle. Him being a ranger was the reason our bloodline still exists. Since then, his descendants have trained as rangers. So, what about you two, Killian? Glenn? You mentioned you mercenaries? We were once mercenaries of the band of the Iron Bull. Huh. <laughs> That's a name well familiar. You were quite famous. Yeah, sometimes our name alone is enough to make the enemy drop their weapons. You speak in the past? We were involved in the Battle of Wirenshire, and Taran King captured the city, and we would claim it for Gravos. As you heard, it didn't end very well. The explosion that devoured everything. A good, our good name was dragged for the mud, and we lost a lot of assignments. That's why our captain took on the mission in the first place. We had to advance for the front lines as vanguard to cut off our supply for either of their cannons. It was a suicide mission, but we were promised a lot of money. It was foolish for us. Honest. By that time, we thought we were the greatest, yet, undefeated, we thought we were immortal. Then the worst happened. And without Wyan shy of wishing, there was no winning, there was no payout. Kylan was the captain's right-hand man, and I was the sky island pilot. We're now the only survivors of this battle. Afterwards, we returned to the three cities, and this was the end of the Band of the Iron Bull. You know how I, exactly how I see it. As long as we're alive, the Band of the Iron Bull still exists. But it's just me, you and me now. The right hand of a dead man, and a pilot without a sky armor. As long as I live and breathe, I'm not going to give it this troop. What are you doing in the palace? I think that's a story for another campfire. 
He's right. We should get some sleep. Tomorrow will be a long day. Sleep well. I mean, that's literally a, a stopping point right there, right? Like, that's that's a camp. We've had a night. Honestly, the day started off not very successful with those multitude of losses. But in the end, we did manage to get through this bloody dungeon. I'm still enjoying this game, but God, I gotta say, it's definitely a little bit harder than I was expecting. Can't just grind my way through this like I would usually love to do. Either way, it's been fun so far, and I look forward to continuing it next time when we work our way through this cave and hopefully into a brand new land and a little bit more power. Thank you for joining me. This has been Chain Echoes once again, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.